Sorry about that guys, but the gamekeeper's just come down. So talking for nearly half an hour. Pain. Mind back this. So I've had my burgers and that and the bread cakes while he's been studying, I can't believe. The fire's gone out near enough, but just to know enough bit of bacon where I can then that'll be it. So it's not been a very good video, lads, I'm afraid, but... Never mind. It's really a cracking day, it's a lovely day, nice and sunny and not bad, warm enough. So we're now in Poolwood. I'll give you a quick run round. You can see gamekeepers just going now, like on a back, shoot what he's having and all that across the area that car is. And there's a little sewage works over there, you can't smell it, it's pretty much alright. Like. And this is Poolwood here. And Bazaar is right between them trees, right over there. It's got me a little bit of bacon going on now. Can't really stoke a fire up and start cutting wood down while gamekeepers here, so I'll have to let it run down that. I'm going to have a brew in a minute. No, I'm sorry it's not been a good video, guys, but I can't really help. It's, it's just. Uh, Come at the wrong time, he has really, but so never mind. I ain't got much time today. She wants to go shopping, so that's not very good, is it? So I had my sister in law here yesterday. Bloody hell, fire. I've had more fun paint council tax. Bit of grease on old Jack Law. That'll do it world of good. A bro now in this Yugoslavia. That's good. Looking forward to Baza guys and all that on Tuesday. <coughs> Disappointed with this morning, but I'm not looking over that.
been exit blocking today, guys. I haven't tried it with exit blocking yet, so. Is it a whirl we're at in? It's going to be in two parts, guys. The simple reason is, I'll tell you, my computer's off blink big time. And once my camera shuts off, then it processes it straight away. So I've like got to do, start again, like you know what I mean. I've got to do two lots, so this will be in two, two parts. Part one and part two. Part one's not really any good anyway. So just, just started it up and then the game people come like so. Watch out, Bob. Bob is living in hope. And that's about all he's gonna get, I know, because I'm hungry this morning. Cooked it to perfection, actually, that. Marvellous. Mm -hmm. Got that smoky taste, you know. Can't beat it. Worked pretty well, that. I've now got to take three others for bush craft breakfast. First one. I'm going to tag is my mate Fleabag. 76, I think it is. So, Fleabag, you've been tagged. Next one I'm going to tag is. Never think about this. Who can we tag? I think I'll tag my mate, Tony. Nice talk. Over there in beautiful County Cork in Ireland. So you've been tagged, Tony. And my third tag will be who oh, can we get out for a tag? So I think We'll tag Mick, just to bushcraft. Obviously, you don't have to do them before Christmas if you can't get out like and whenever you can get out and do them. So that's flea bag, Lee. Night talk, I think it's 63, 76 or 63, 70, something like that. Sorry for that, Tony, if I can't get it right. Tony, my mate over in Ireland. And Mick at just to bushcraft. There are my three tags.
it's been a right pain to light a fire today. Everything was absolutely soaking wet. We said this week it's like a swamp, I didn't think it would be, but it is. It's full of water. I have a right job on lighting it. Yeah. There you go. My wife had a surprise yesterday. I bought her a uh, 40 inch flat screen LCD TV yesterday. And got it all up and running. Oh, she loves it. Now she can watch Constipation Street. Big characters. EastEnders. Bloody Emmerdale, bloody farm. Oh dear, good luck. Not about you was, but I what when you watch that, it used to be good at one time, that Emmerdale farm. It used to be a good programme. Because it always used to be on farm basically, but now all they do is in pub. You know what I mean? It's, it's always in pub, that's all they do. Fighting and bloody... I don't know, all sorts of different things like that. No, you call it Emmerdale now instead of Emmerdale Farm because it's bloody rubbish. And Constipation Street, oh my god. Supposed to be true to life. Bloody hell, fire. Oh, there's a lot of rubbish. Ah, so she's well up at Mrs. now. I could have had that. Oh, you Bob. Huh? Right, full spine. Oh, we have all sorts today. I went to a car boat last week and uh, there were this butcher's van there. And I thought, oh, I haven't seen this butcher's van here before. And uh, I thought, I'll have a look, see what they've got. Anyhow, they've got an offer on or something. Steak, chicken fillets, and pork loin chops, 25 quid. I thought, well, that's all right. Well, it's never, you've never seen such crap in your life. I put a piece of steak in frying pan, so I don't I like it medium rare, me, a bit of blood running out. Put it in frying pan, well, you could have bloody done your shoes with it, you could have sold your bloody shoes with it. Put a best of it, cut it up, put it in a curry, and I did it, and I left it for two days, this curry, let it tenderise meat, and it was still exactly the same, like chewing bloody rubber. So next Sunday, I'm going to go, and they're going to get a ballocking. Pork steaks are tough as old boots. Chicken fillets, dog's had. 
But dogs had them and they weren't that struck on them, they weren't keen on them. They were absolutely rubbish. Absolute rubbish. There you go. You learn, don't you? Yes, this has bought me a uh, Kindle Fire HD for Christmas. I had a right job getting one, so I booked it on August. Anyhow, they'd only got two left in Boston. That's sorry, Lincoln. So I went to pick, pick it up, got it. This was about a fortnight ago. I picked it up, got it, took it back home. My wife said to me, she's upstairs, she says, did you get one? I says, yeah. She says, let me have a look. So I went upstairs to her, showed her box. And she says, that's it, you're not having that now. I says, what do you mean? She says, I'm going to wrap it up for Christmas. I thought, well, you bugger. So she went, let me have it, <laughs> have it until Christmas. So I, I might take that telly off her yet. <laughs> so you know, it's something to look forward to Christmas Day. And get to... Uh, and get YouTube on it and it's got a webcam built into it type of thing. Then we're straight onto Skype. I talked to old Bribo and Sandy and that on Skype and JC and Foggy on Skype, so it's a cracking day to be out today guys, lovely day. If it's like this next week when we go up to Baza it'll be brilliant. It'll be really good. Looking forward to it, can't wait. I haven't fetched Frankie today because I've took him out this morning. But he's a, he, he's, a, he's a pain in here, especially in here. Plus, his sheep on next field. Bob's not bothered, he's as quiet as he's good as gold. He's going tight, his eyes are shutting. Oh, he's as good as gold, Bob is. But I'm having the right job uploading that. That video I uploaded yesterday on this youngest Lavian mess kit from uh, Bootsville. Some of you have had a struggle finding it, but uh, uh, there's definitely on there. Anyway, I looked last night, I think they've got nine of these mess sets left. So if you want one, guys, say it's 9 99 but don't make it, don't pay 9 99 make an offer and see what they take. Should get it for about six, seven quid, I would have thought. I would think so, anyhow. These are them pouches that I got from Dale Warrior, he doesn't put scouts, he bought two, Mark two for his birthday, bless him. Couldn't get a kit. <coughs> That's about it guys, I'm going to have this cuppa. And then uh, get back home. Well, she wants to go to Aldi's today. So, God, I hate shopping. I can't. I hate it. Full weight. 
if I go, to, if I go shopping, I'm in and out. I've done in 10 minutes, but she takes her hours. Why is it women always, when they go shopping, they have to look round and... Why can't they just go for something what they want and that's it? They have to look round, oh, but just have a look down this aisle, they look down this aisle too. Well, oh, I've got this today, she said it's on offer, cheap. I said, but we don't bloody have it, we never have it like that. Yeah. You can't tell them, can you? you can't tell them. It's all right, that. Spot on. That's right. Drink it out at corner. It's all right. Smashing. Except for that price, guys. It's great just to put it in your pocket, like I said. So as you can see, I've only come out for a bit of a breakfast. I've had two burgers and, and two bread cakes, and then I've had sandwiches. And I've still fetched me, still fetched me old, uh, the old looks I can't. I'll have this and then make my way back. I've got about a mile to walk, somewhere like that. Look at me a look. Bob? You good lad? Eh? Good as gold, mate, aren't you? Eh? You're as good as gold, lad, aren't you? Not like your bloody brother, Frankie. Right, guys. I want to drink this and then make my way back. So. Next video that I'll be doing now is Bazana. Uh, this will take me hours to upload this. Last night, just that little video where it took me only four hours to upload it. I can't go through a movie maker, my movie maker's not had it like with this bloody virus or whatever I've got on computer, God knows. So it could be tomorrow before you see this like. So you've got your tags, flea bag, Tony, and make it Jester Bushcraft. Bushcraft breakfast, just see how we go with it. So I'll have to get across one day and go and see Tony one day in Ireland. Uh, I've been to Ireland 11 times, like we used to go to Athlone, they'll have a lot of fishing when we were younger and that. Fantastic place, fantastic people. Absolutely love it. If I didn't live in Lincolnshire, I'd, I'd, I'd think about moving to Ireland. Such a beautiful, beautiful place. And people, so laid back and friendly, it's unbelievable. Fantastic people. So, oh, for the good guys, I'll tell you what I had yesterday, one of my mates, he's a Londoner, comes from London. We've all done, we've been a Londoner. And uh, he fetched me some, I've never tried it before, some jelly deals. Bloody hell fire. You want some bloody guts to eat them. You know, the, the taste, to be quite honest with you, obviously being from Yorkshire, I like tripe and all that lot. And the taste, similar to tripe, they don't taste fishy. A bit of salt and pepper on them and a bit of vinegar on them, like, they're not bad. But I've definitely had better things than that, like, but they're all right, they're not bad, I suppose, but... Ish. Right, guys, that's it, I'm going. I'll see you later on, guys. Bye for now. And don't forget, let's be careful out there. Bye for now.